Alright, welcome back everybody. I'm LazyFire, this is Tomb Raider, and I got a new skill. Uh, it's going to give me more salvage from animals, and I updated my Lara! Pistol. What the hell happened? This storm, it came out of nowhere. These clouds, they just surrounded the plane. Lara, listen. I saw the crash from here, so you must be close to my position. Just get back here safe. All right. <sighs> On my way. Anyways, I've upgraded my pistol, so it's going to have a little bit more accuracy and damage to it, which means it'll be a little bit more useful. I'm still going to be using my bow as my primary. But we've got to get to the pilot and, by extension, to Roth. And we've seen some freaky shit. This is, uh, this is playing into the nobody leaves the island thing that we've been seeing all over the place. And I just, you know, this is another nice vista here. The game actually forces you to look that way and won't let you steer away from it. Over here! Fire from the side! Yeah, I couldn't get my gun up until after that guy hit me in the face with that machete. Oh, this is a pretty cool sequence. It happens a couple times in the game. Where you uh, get hung upside down. This is the rope arrow. The rope arrow will uh, basically serve as a mobile zip line. It'll allow you to uh, mess with the environment a little bit. So, so let's take this support down and it takes out that. So the rope arrow, uh, despite the fact that it looks like it uses arrow ammo, does not actually use arrow ammo. So if you don't have any arrows, uh, you're totally fine. So there are some limits to uh, the arrow ammo, uh, overall, or the arrow, overall, uh, or the, the rope, jeez. Uh, one is that, at this point, it doesn't move everything you think it There's got to be a way up. And, yes, you can pull objects wrapped in rope. So let's get ourselves over here. That's wrapped in rope. Well, now I can see nothing. Thanks. Ah, but what are you actually supposed to do? Shoot this thing here. I just like showing off the, uh, the little effects that the game gives you for this. Now, I could actually move that closer as well. Just that. I think that's a pretty neat thing. And this means that we can go back to the, uh, the forest village where we first found Roth and uh, pick up a couple of things that we uh, couldn't get before. So there will be a roundup video in our future. Uh, right now, this game is introducing us to the rope ammo, which means yeah, that we like have... a good spot uh, to hook into. Yeah. We've got to be shown pretty much everything. <laughs> right, so this is gonna be pretty common, traversing the levels on these uh, rope arrows like this. And those white posts are going to be our only way back and forth across a lot of stuff for a while. Uh, that said, there's a little bit more in this area that I'm going to pick up first. Hmm, I thought I had more need for arrows than that. So let's really quickly get on top of here. Oh yes, that's right. I don't know why, but I forget stuff sometimes. Uh, so it's not actually dangerous to jump in here, it's sort of a tutorial area for you. You should be able to fire a rope up there. Yes, let's do that. I always forget that's how you have to get up there. I always think that you have to go from the other side. It's just for a bit of salvage, though. But, I mean, every little bit's gonna count for a while. Or XP. I thought they were salvaging that, too. So, we're done in this little spot here. Let's open up a door. Great. I like how the textures all just disappear after, uh, like, a half second. Ooh, I'm getting some frame rate issues here. I've never had free rate issues in this game. And it's rough. I'm 
really glad you moved. <laughs> you and me both, girl. One moment they were fine, the next. There was this storm. It came out of nowhere. It's not your fault, Lara. I called them here, Roth. Hey, we'll find another way. Uh, mayday, mayday. Co-pilot, Jessica Bear. Another pilot. One, seven, seven, eight. Hello? Hello? Can you hear me? Yeah, badly hurt when I landed. I need to bring aid. Is anyone there? Captain Jessup, do you read? I've deployed a smoke signal. Please respond. Damn it, he can't hear me. I have to get to him. No. His signal's just over there. We've got our own people to worry about. We'll need to regroup as soon as they find Sam. I can't just leave him out there alone. I need to get to him. Sometimes you've got to make sacrifices, Lana. You can't save everyone. I know about sacrifices. No. You know about loss. Sacrifice is a choice you make. Loss is a choice made for you. I can't choose to let him die, Roth. Okay, well, I misspoke that we were actually right back with the uh, village we found Roth in now. Um, but it's a little exploded after the aircraft came down. But that means there's some nice things on the aircraft. And it means that we don't have to do too much. Damage. We ain't gonna find anyone up here. You're probably right. We got orders. I'm gonna head down and join the others at the. You hear that? I hope Hold he on, I'll take a look. No! I did it! Yes, we're about to start encountering a lot of enemies with guns. Uh, they're not too troubling, but when they get on you in force, it's a major issue. Uh, so it's best to identify. Uh, I'm here, Reyes. What's your situation? We followed a group of men to some kind of city. This place is insane, Rock. What the hell are they doing here? I don't know, and I don't think I want to know. Any sign of Sam or Whitman? Nothing yet. Are you with Lara? Yes. We'll be uh, heading down the mountain soon to meet up with you. Okay. We'll try to get in a bit closer. Keep this channel open. Right. Anyways, you want to avoid the guys with guns or take them out first. Pretty much every time you see them. Uh, even if you're using guns yourself, they are still pretty dangerous. <laughs> I think I can make this jump. Yes, I can. Sweet. It's like this. Yeah, the little bits of XP help, so I'm gonna take advantage of those where I can. Ooh, that was weird. So, you're meant to keep going here, but if you uh, rope yourself back down this way and check out the stuff near the plane, you'll be handsomely rewarded. I've separated the finds out into a roundup section at the end of this video. Here we are. I took a bit of a detour. I picked up a relic and got a little bit of salvage while I was down there. Uh, you'll see the, or sorry, the uh, the relic will be at the end of the video. But right now we're moving on. As you can see, that's where our objective is. So we took a nice little detour to get here. Uh, yes, we're. On our way here. There's the signal. There is our next step. Uh, as before, if you hit your survival instinct button, you will see all your different climbables. Uh, now those include ropes and where you can attach to them. So if you ever get lost in these areas, just start spamming your survival instinct. It never runs out. And. Uh, I guess if you hit A and X at the same time, the game does not like that. Come on, jump. we gotta get back. Shut up and let me finish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi. Chokes. I wonder if I can push this guy off. Yes, that didn't work. Apparently if he turns around, he can't get pushed off. Since I pushed that first guy off, I've been kind of trying to do it in different ways. But... As you can see from Laura's stance, we're back into sneak mode. Lighten up stacking a few detours in this mission just because of the way it works. Let's get across this canyon. Uh, the reason I'm, I'm going on these detours is because there are collectibles in areas uh, that are backwards, down, and all this stuff, and there's just a lot of exploration I have to do to get to those items. So 
that means there's a few minutes where I'm going to be out of the world, uh, and I don't really want to make you watch me backtrack too long. We're actually right near, sorry, we're right near a secret tomb. That tomb will be our next video, and after that we'll go through the remaining area. Thanks for watching everybody, there's a bit of a roundup after this, and I will hopefully see you next time. Yes. So yes, it's a good idea to get down here right after you get in trouble. I... I don't remember this. I've got to find out if this is actually a trap. I guess not. Hey, an artifact. This must have belonged to a U.S. Marine. Were they on the island in force, or just an advance party? Alright, and this one has some hidden information. It's not too hard to find. Do these marks represent friends lost, or enemies killed? Either way, he needed a drink. What I want to do is get some of the stuff in here, which is much more fun. Baby, I don't even know how to begin this, so I'm just going to come right out with it. Alicia is yours. Maybe you've known it all along, but since I signed back on board the Endurance, I just can't keep the truth from you any longer. You've got to understand, I never meant to cut you out of her life, but I know you, Roth. I know how you live and what you want. Staying in one place and raising a kid is not on your agenda. Maybe I screwed up. Maybe I should have let you make a choice. But I made it for you, for what I thought was best. After the expedition, when the time is right, let's talk about the future. Take some time to think about what you want, okay? Yes, our bow pickups have allowed us to make the recurve bow. It's going to be a stronger version of our bow, and let's go over to salvage because there's new things. A key ring trigger. We want this. We want this bad. An increase. A kind of mortar and pestle, probably used for preparing medicinal herbs. There are small bone fragments in the mortar well. Hopefully, animal bones. <laughs> 